speaker. Uh, <clears throat> excuse me, if I may, um, Ms. Flory, I just want to correct, you did not vote at the Vector Control Board. I'm sorry, sir, this is a public hearing related to this specific yes, item. Thank you, Mayor Fitzgerald. I, I wanted to ask that the council delay the vote on this and remove the 40 acre term from this item. There's a preschool on Harbor Boulevard that went up for sale because it went out of business. I guess it could make it go. And I guess it sold. It was owned by the Lutheran Church. And ironically, some of the homeowners in the adjoining parcels were approached to sell their property. You know, if the price is right, things move. What could ostensibly happen with the way this is written is if you could get enough people to sell their homes that are already zoned residential that would be eligible for residential development, you could take entire swaths of this community and bulldoze them and put up housing at the density levels that have been mentioned here tonight, and quite possibly they could be changed in the future. So if we're, if we're going to be dealing with small infill projects, I don't understand why we're using such a huge term to encompass the amount of land that would be involved in these so-called small infill projects. Now, I don't know how many times I've heard the word development in this room, but I have to tell you, since I started showing up here a couple of years ago, I don't hear anybody talking about the roads. I don't hear anybody talking about what we're going to do about the, the traffic synchronization failure that we have. But I hear a lot of talk about how we're going to keep building this place to, to kingdom come. And I don't understand why no one here wants to deal with these issues, because we don't have the money. Has it already been spent? I believe it has. I mean, The roads are terrible. I had a friend of mine come up. He lives in Anaheim. And by the way, I spent a lot of time driving around Orange County. I'm an insurance agent. And the roads in Fullerton, bar none, are the worst in Orange County. They really are. I mean, that's not a deb that's, 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 that's a fact. He come up to my house. He come up, Raymond. He said, Joe, that's the worst road I've ever driven on in my entire life. And I have to agree with him. And that's, that's the entry point to the nice neighborhood of Raymond Hills. So if I wanted to stick – a computer program on these video meetings and determine how many times the word developments come up in here and, and compare that to how many times the word road repair has come up in here. I think we have to go back to the drawing board and put the reins and the brakes on these projects. The residents need to have a say and we need to have sane policy and we need to slow this thing down. Thank you. Thank you. Next speaker.